Buddy. Gotta get a The conveyor belt of food. coming for buddy better not be me I just got here there's also a little frog that lives in that pot they don't want to spook you oh 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 sorry I'm sorry okay I'll stop and for some reason murder hornets like the sap that comes from this tree but other than them living in suburban Japan this is very suburban it's not that different than living in suburban America see people have minivans Boy, you show up to soccer practice and that everyone will know how cool you are I think it looks cool houses like hundreds of years old or no? And like, what's that? Is that a politician or a lawyer? I should probably know whose country I'm in. You'll notice that there's not really much of a setback. These houses are like right on the edge of the street. There aren't any sidewalks. It's like in America, the houses are so far over, they have like an acre of wasted land, but not here. What is it? Some statues. Oh, some weird statues? You don't know what those are? I thought Japanese people knew how to park, but I guess I was wrong. We're gonna have to find a spot for this. This is very, very unstable. Feels like in America you get a lawsuit for this kind of playground equipment. Good job, buddy. So there is stuff like this in America, but definitely the safety aspect here is very, very different. That is a pretty big slide. Oh, there she is. Okay, she's safe. Whoa, this is like something from like a James Bond movie. Look at that. I don't even know if this thing is safe for adults. Oh. 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 That's the thing with this country. If you do something stupid, it's kind of like you're expected to be accountable for that action yourself, not whoever made this contraption and thought that it was safe for anybody. No, no, they're not at fault for putting that pit right there that I fell into. I'm at fault for falling in and it hurts. I guess you just roll on it like a conveyor belt at a factory. Let's go. Job, and here comes mommy. Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. That might be the best slide I've ever ridden on. <laughs> I feel like this whole playground might be illegal in America. I feel like this Japanese Gatorade is the right choice. It is hot out. This is called Kaiten's 
sushi. It comes on a conveyor belt, and oh, I don't want those, but you just pick what you want. You eat it, it's charged by the plate. And which one can I not take? So if it's in the red, that's like a special order. I do want some sauce, though. And it's only been a couple of minutes. Oh, it just got bigger. Other than eating, there's only one flaw with this, and that is that you're only supposed to pick with stuff that's here, but sometimes on the other side, you'll see stuff that you want, and then somebody down there takes it. Oh, I thought he was gonna take it. You had, what, seven plates? Yeah. And I had 13 plates? Quite a few problems. Chain keeps falling off. But no one took care of it. I found it in the garage and this is my only means of getting anywhere. like these odd little trails that I've been discovering and look they're next to rich people's houses. I'm guessing they're rich because they got a German luxury car which no one needs or should buy because in my experience they're unreliable. But this neighborhood it is like reliably fun and an endless source of discovery. In fact I used to ride on trails like this when I was a little kid but they weren't near like a river like that. And look at this weird like retaining wall that kind of elevates everything. That's interesting. Then over here it ends there's like an actual bridge. You see this weird metal conduit right here? I'm not really sure what's in here. If it's like electrical wires or something, there's a few of these. I see them on at least one side of every bridge. Maybe it's on the other side of this one. Nope, doesn't look like it. Cool, check this thing out. Wonder what it says. Come on, Google Translate. Uh, something about a commitment farm is what that little sign says. Maybe it's like some sort of community donation thing, which would make sense. Look at this, there's like someone's garden. It's probably a community garden. And then we got ourselves a tiny little row of apartments. If you wanna know what it's like to live and something like that, or actually what it's like to live in one of these traditional houses, definitely subscribe if you're not, because I rented one of those and I'm gonna go live in it. It's like out in the country. They're dropping me off and I have to like survive. Pick another video up here. I'll see you in the next one.